So you found the bomb maker, linked everything to Ark? Not exactly. Jesus, Jensen. We did find the bomb maker. Allison Stanek, a local resident. We have her in custody now. But she told me she'd made dozens more bombs before we arrested her, and she delivered them to Viktor Marchenko. So it was Ark? A splinter faction inside Ark. I'm telling you, Miller, something more is going on here. Stanek told me Marchenko has a base of operations in the Swiss Alps, a research facility called Garum. That sound like something Ark has the resources for to you? I'll contact McCready. Get him and a few analysts to work up a plan. We need to move on this now. Chicane and I can fly there and back, get a lay of the land, while Mac and his team do the research. Really? Got it all figured out in that clockwork head of yours. Oh, what the hell? I'm in. You got enough fuel to get to Switzerland? To get us there, sure. Fine. Do it. But this is recon only. Do not engage. Contact me the minute you have something. Yes, sir. You've proven yourself so far on this one, Jensen. Don't screw it up. Tell me that. Miller is not used to giving compliments, is he? He's getting static from the brass. He's starting to riot in Gollum over that shit with Rucker. I'm sure he doesn't blame you much anymore. And what do you think? I think tracking that bomb maker was some fine work. If the intel you got from her stands true, Gollum City will be the least of our problems. So what do you say we go find out how deep in it we are, right? You all set? Hey, when we get to the Alps, we could get into some action. Are you ready for that? Why? Because I've been flying hack for the last few years. That's the thing about us naturals, Jensen. We never rust. <laughs> Look, I've been doing this a long time. Been in my share of shit, too. I always managed to pull myself out of it. Fair enough. Just don't leave without me. Hey, listen. I know we're not exactly pals, and I know I can be an asshole. But I'm not a fucking asshole. In fact, I'm offended you'd even say something like that. That's not what I meant. I'm just messing with you, Jensen. <laughs> you ready? When we first talked, you told me that your limp kept you honest. That's an interesting way of looking at an injury. Your preamble's as thin as soup, man. Don't dance around it, just ask it. I'm only curious. We've all got a story. No, that's not it. What you really want to know is, do I hate him? men that tore out my knee. His name was Lachlan Beats. He was a laborer. Worked in the mines up near Bendigo before everything went to hell. Beats was a family man who did what he thought he had to do in order to provide for his family. See, back then, nobody could compete with you Ogs when it came to manual labor jobs. So, he made a choice, if you can call it that. And his choice changed your life. You don't resent Beats for what happened? What I resent are the men who coaxed men like him to get augmentations. Men who enforced a system where the rich could buy artificial expertise without thinking about what it would cost all of us in the end. No, I don't resent him. At least not anymore. I was simply in the wrong place at the wrong time. Story of my life. So look, on that sunshiny note, what do you say we put some miles behind us? Not quite. Let me take care of some things first. You know where I'll be.
on like these. Přímo tady ve městě. Lesa mi to tady krká. City has gone to hell. against that kind of thing. City has gone to hell. Not much going on. Can't defend against that kind of thing. Who listens to that garbage? Another 
Greece. Thank <laughs> you. 